Uh, my first question is a little bit uh, of a specific follow up on what you've been talking about with regards to workforce development and workforce training. And when we have our students in high school, there are many clear pathways to college, but there are not clear pathways to careers. And uh, I think that this is something that we need to focus on and prioritize because we're seeing very empty workforce pipelines and we're seeing major skills gaps at thousands of companies across New York State. So my first question has to do with um, what's being done with regards to the career and technical education programs at BOCES? Because there are CTE programs that partner with high schools and many employers want to see students coming out of high schools with very specific skills uh, that they can be utilized right into the workforce. So I love BOCES. Um, it is a woefully underused part of the educational system and I wish that they were more supported unilaterally. I think this is actually more a question for education than for DOL because we don't really, you know, we don't have any impact on their funding and their course offering, but I will tell you that they are very, very valuable. And there's a shocking statistic. Two out of three New York jobs require some post-secondary credential. Right now, 2.4 million New Yorkers between the ages of 25 and 44 have no post-secondary degree or credentials, so they're not eligible. We need to make sure that we get people to understand that training is about your future and that training in BOCES is incredibly impactful. And, you know, we, it's, it's a couple of things. It's making sure that young people in school, you know, in high school and middle school understand those pathways, but it's also once you graduate from secondary school, that you can continue to learn. You can go back and get a credential. You can go back and get an apprenticeship. You can go back to college. We are in an era of lifelong learning. Nobody is gonna get one degree and never go back to school again. BOCES is an incredible part of this, but I urge you to talk to my friends at education because they have more attachment to it than I do. I love it. I, I understand your point about SED. Uh, there's no question about it. I do believe though that labor uh, can support more workforce pathways through CTE. Uh, and uh, partnering with SED um, because, again, we hear from thousands of employers who are saying we have major, major skills gaps right now. And I think BOCES is an important pathway with labor partnering with SED. And we do partner with them. I mean, I, it's one of the things I like actually about the new workforce and economic development uh, office is it gives us more impact in all of those areas. Uh, you and I can talk about this for a long time, I promise you. <laughs> And, and I'd love to have a follow-up conversation because I think it's important, not only for you and I, but for everyone to be aware of what's going on and the opportunities that do reside. This is a 21st century opportunity for our children. Yes. Thank, Thank you. you, Commissioner.